Hey everyone, this is the GMT Show, the general music talk on pod. Peace on demand. Hey guys, welcome back to the GMT Show. I'm Joanna. I'm Rachel. I'm Jessica. And I'm Amy. And today we're going to be discussing the different aspects of music. So Jessica, I heard that your favourite part of music is musical instruments. What musical instrument do you play? I play the flute and I actually wanted to play the flute because apparently whenever I was younger I used to run around with my hands like this like whistling all the time so I just like run around the house doing that including to my mum's point. How easy was it to learn how to play the flute? It probably would have been easy enough if I had actually practiced (laughs) which I didn't which is why I always got in trouble but I think if, uh, if you put the time and the effort into it, it should be pretty easy. Um, do you fi- did you find it fun, like? I really enjoyed it. I maybe might have been at, like too young. I was at the age mm. where nothing really mattered, so I was just really careless, and that's why I didn't really practice. So would you recommend it to people now? I would. It makes you feel special. It makes you like stand out in the crowd. But like I suppose it depends on what type of person you're because like mm-hmm. depends like, like different person wants different instruments. Yeah, because like you might want to play the flute and someone else might have played like the electric guitar or something like that. Speaking of guitars, Rachel, I hear you play the guitar. Yeah, I do play the guitar, but I played it. I started about three years ago, but I haven't really played it since like a year ago. But my granny always wanted me to play it, so I might start again. But I don't know. Um, does anybody else do any music lessons or any instruments? I do sing in school. Do you, like, do you enjoy it? Yeah, I think it's really fun and it's a good way of just escaping. What's your favourite song you sing? Well, I'm in the middle of my grades and I don't really like doing the same songs over and over mm-hmm. again. Mm-hmm. But I love all the songs from A Star Is Born. I think they're really good. But like A good thing about music is there's lots of different genres. So it's like different genre for like a different person. Yeah, like but like I don't really have a favorite. I just like listen to whatever is like on the radio or so on my phone. But like it depends on the person, like or the age group. Like my granddad loves country music, and then like my sister would prefer like pop music and all. Mm-hmm. What would be your favorite genre, Jessica? I I think I like pop. See, my brother's kind of got me into country because he's gone into this country phase and he just blasts yeah. it around the house like. <laughs> Every single day, it's really annoying. Yeah, sometimes. but like, we like still like listen to music. It was like back when our like moms and dads were like younger. Like, and there's like people like Michael Jackson and like Elvis. Like everybody knows who they mm-hmm. are. They you were know? like the legends that started off all of the yeah. music. Like, like the people can have loads of different favorite kinds of music. Like cult, like different cultures, like different things. Like the way mm-hmm. like. Like like a lot of Muslims like like Bollywood and things like that. Whereas like here we like like can whistle and like Irish dancing. Well, it depends, but like a lot of people like Irish dancing and stuff. Is there any genres like you hate or anything? Oh, hate? I don't like rap music. Rap, no, because no, they're no, purely no. like they're just mumble. mumble. Yeah, and, like it's usually all just full of swear and it never makes sense. It's yeah. impressive how fast they can do it, but it doesn't mm-hmm. make any. Yeah, sense. like yeah, it, it is pretty awesome. cool, but like I don't like it. Like. So dramatic, and then like all they do is keep like mentioning their names in the middle of the yeah. song, like mm-hmm. Cardi B and stuff like that. I mean, how do you think music has changed like over the years? Well, it's changed a lot. Like back in like seventies, it was all like disco in the eighties. It was like, yeah. it's a bit different to that in the nineties. It's all kind of like rave, and now it's like, it's like yeah. Ariana Grande and yeah. all. Yeah. But so, Lane, I've heard you like listen to radio and like the charts and all. Yeah, I like to just put the radio on when I'm in the car or play music when I'm doing my homework or revising or just even just sitting in my room. Who do you think would be the most popular singers and bands at the moment? Well, I personally love Little Mix, but Ariana Grande is very popular. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And um, Louis Capaldi is getting really popular. He's like top of the charts right now. Yeah. Like how do you, like, how do you think the charts work? I think it's all to do with like people listening and streaming and they just count up how many people have done that and then Mm. they like rate it according to them 
Yeah, but like it's also weird where like the way we listen to music has changed so much in like the past like like fifty years. Like yeah. used to be like record players now. Mm-hmm. Rare mm-hmm. like rarely yeah, anybody really like listens to the radio now. Yeah. yeah, like just streaming yeah. it and stuff. Well, it's like, like all about phones now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What was your favorite era of like music of the eighties, the nineties? I think now is very good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, well, it yeah. really depends because like some songs are good and then other songs you're like, what the heck is that? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but like, I just get it. I just like get Deezer and just like download, make my like a thousand accounts, just get all the free trials. <laughs> <laughs> but like, I've heard you like a lot of bands and singers, Rachel. Yeah, I do like a lot of bands, but mm-hmm. I've got two favorites, probably the Vamps or Why Don't We, because they have like such good songs now. Like. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, how do you like? How do you think bands like get popular? Like. I think it's to do with social media or yeah. the kind of songs they post and people like hear them and then they could become popular and then everybody finds out about them yeah, and then more people listen to them. You saw me on magazines and now you can see it on like social media, you can see like what they're eating, like where yeah. they are, yeah. what they're yeah. doing. You, know, and and you can just yeah. see yeah. their day to their life. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Sometimes you just put up things that really aren't meant to be up. Yeah. Like it's yeah. meant to stay <laughs> private. <laughs> Yeah. Rachel, who would you say is most popular right now? For bands, probably would be like Little Mix and Westlife's becoming kind of popular yeah. as well. Mm-hmm. Um, and some singers would probably be like Ariana Grande. Yeah, as well. and there's like yeah. Cardi B and Nicki Minaj. Yeah. <laughs> like enemies, like right now. Yeah. yeah. But like, is there any bands that like have been forgotten, do you think? Like, in like. Coldplay, oh, it's Coldplay, yeah, Coldplay, 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 Twenty One Pilots. Yeah, yeah they're direction. they're really good. Like, but, like, obviously, yeah, yeah. 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 Up, but like, yeah. I do think there's still people that listen to them. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They're, they're like waiting on them to come back. There's like only yeah. a few, few songs I think of theirs that are actually good. Yeah, like, yeah, I can still remember. Yeah, I can't yeah. remember yeah. I know, yeah, but like, hits. even yeah. though a lot of the music is similar now, it's still loads of different genres. So yeah. what have you been think? What do you like? How do you? What's your experience with Co- Corey Mela been so far? I think Corey Mela has been a really good experience, mm-hmm. and the staff are really nice. Like as soon as we get out, got out of the bus, we were like getting high five and fist bumps. Yeah, yeah. And, and, like, and they were just really nice. It's so. such an energetic place. Yeah. yeah, and they're all from like different like places like America, Canada, Germany. all that. Yeah. yeah, and yeah. like they're just, like they're so nice. I was so anxious to come here. I thought I wouldn't mix well with people because I'm like really shy. And yeah. Then as soon as yeah. we got here, the people are also friendly, and they have so many activities to bring us all closer together. Yeah. yeah. Like, whenever we were doing the workshops, like I was so nervous because I do not mix well. I thought I would just like hide and <laughs> cry in a corner, literally. Yeah. yeah. Like, I was so shy. We were like all like getting the data on all on our phones because like we thought like we we're gonna be using them all the time, but like. We've barely ever used them, like, mm-hmm. and like we've been eating so we've much. Been talking like, way yeah. more to people now. Yeah, yeah it's so much better. We, we yeah. spend our less time on the phone, and we don't do we don't need it for you as much as we thought we would. Like we were out doing a scan for a hundred earlier. It was really oh yeah, fun. that's a fun. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's really competitive. Fun. But like yeah. we eat all like healthy foods and like just like. It's, it's really fun. It's like yeah. very different to expect. I thought it'd just be like all like work and like. It's a really calming environment yeah. as well. It's really relaxing. Yeah, yeah. like chill. Yeah. Like Never we come from like yeah. an integrated school already because like mm-hmm. it's kind of like we're already used to this type yeah, stuff. We're used to like people mm-hmm. coming from different backgrounds. But how yeah. does it feel coming from a like a like, just a normal type school? Yeah. I don't think it really like matters. Yeah. I mean, yeah. yeah. Like, I guess we like it's such a good opportunity to because meet all the people, make yeah. new people, make new friends and all. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah, because like everybody like, it's been a really, really good experience. It's and, been like so nice. Like all of them, like the staff have been from like different countries and like mm-hmm. they're just like so nice. Like if you're like just sitting on your own or something, they just come over and like sit beside you. Yeah. It really just comes to show that it doesn't matter where you come from or what your backstory is. It's just everything is just going to be okay because yeah, yeah. it's like all about accepting people and mm-hmm. being friendly. And mm-hmm. at that point, we've just about run out of time. And in conclusion, music can affect different people in different ways. And also, belonging is really important to some people yeah, as well. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, my name is Jessica. My name's Amy. My name's Rachel. My name's Delana. And this has been the GTM Show. Bye. Bye. Bye.